What if water is God? Then that would mean God is both in us and all around us. That God is both above and below us. Why a woman's water breaks when we're born and why some religions observe the ritual of baptism. But if water was God, then that would mean that God has no gender. That God takes the shape of whatever container God appears in, which would explain why we have so many different belief systems. Which begs the question, what is the spiritual significance of poisoning the water in Flint, Michigan? Or the oil burning in the Gulf of Mexico? Or the large islands of garbage floating in the Pacific Ocean? If God was water, would that not mean that every natural place is holy? That every thunderstorm was a church without walls? That when the rain falls, it's an act of God's death giving life? And when it evaporates again, it's the day of resurrection? And life itself was just a test of learning how to be and flow like water. How to give life to other people and how to refresh their spirits and quench their thirst with your presence.